Hey everyone, it's your girl Shamay Speaks coming to you today for a Soul Searching Sundays. You know, I love to make videos. If you follow me, you know I love to make videos when I get out of church because my mind just be going. Well, it's always going, but it'd be extra going in church. But um, I was thinking about things and, you know, in church they talk about God has an ability to renew your mind. And I really firmly believe that, but I do know that it's a personal decision with inside you that you have to make in order for that to happen. So when you search deep, there's some things that you need to undo so you can renew. And people don't understand that. Once you undo things, which is not an overnight thing, you can renew. And as you renew, they become more undone, if you guys understand what I'm saying. You know, a lot of people are in they find themselves in bitterness, bondage, and, and I've been in those situations. I know if you follow me, you know I talk about my situation with my daughter's father and the things that I went through. And I tell you, like, in the last year, maybe year and a half now at this point, my mind has just been on a so um, different level. And I think because of the situation, I re realized a lot of things about myself and that my change was internal. And so... I learned a lot of things about myself which made me renew my mind because my happiness and my daughter's happiness comes before anything and life is too short to be sitting there miserable but you do have the power to renew your mind and change. You know, you got to ask yourself if you're dealing with a drama situation whether it's with your kids, fathers, people in your family and you keep on dealing with it and you are not changing because you can't change other people only can change yourself. So you have to ask yourself are you tired yet? Are you tired of the drama yet? Are you tired of being upset, bitter, angry, disappointed? Are you tired? Because if you're tired, it's time to start undoing to renew. But it's a purpose thing you have to do. You have to do this on purpose. You know, another lady, T Boogie on my Facebook, she always says be positive on purpose. It is a must that you are positive on purpose. Anything you do is on purpose. And I always compare it to a drug addict who's getting off drugs. Honey, you got to go to meetings on purpose. You got to go to rehab on purpose. You got to be strong and pray on purpose. You have to be on, everything you do has to be on purpose and come from within in order to undo and renew, period. But it is so possible. And remember this, it's always easy to stay in the drama, but nothing easy is ever worth it. If you think about the things that you've get, got that's been easy, usually it's not worth it. And the things that give you the biggest internal payoff is never easy because it takes a lot of work to get to a place of a renewed mind, but you can have that. So ask yourself, as I said, if you're in a situation, are you tired yet? Are you tired yet? Are you ready to do something different? You can't change them, but you can change and renew you. So remember that. Do everything on purpose. Listen to motivational things on purpose. Join the church. Pray on purpose. Think positive on purpose. And as you start to create that habit, trust me, your mind will renew. But everything that you renew is within you. And if you don't know that, you got to do some soul searching. So it's Soul Searching Sunday. It's your girl Shamay Speaks. Check out my books, my videos, my YouTube, um, my Facebook, and you can go on my website, ShamaySpeaks.com. If you order any of my books, I um, autograph them personally for you. So remember that you can undo and renew your mind, and God will always give you the power to come anew. Be positive, make positive changes, and work on your mindset, and be purposeful when you do it.